Welcome back to Back to the Beginning, the Let's Play series that I started over two years ago, two years ago, probably like almost exactly two years ago. It's coming back, back to the beginning every single Saturday or Sun or Friday, depending on where you are in the world. It'll basically be Saturday for everyone. But yeah, this is basically where I just play the game with you guys and uh, go through all the quest lines. So you either kind of, I feel like you either kind of like it or you don't like it. But we're currently on a horse which doesn't have any tack. So I thought maybe we check out this shop here and buy some stuff for this account because I've accumulated quite the amount of star coins. Now I don't want to buy everything. I just thought, hey, let's tack up our horse a little bit. I feel like this saddle blanket here I kind of like it. Let's buy it. Oh gosh, it was kind of expensive. Let's buy this black one here. This black saddle here. And this silver sapphire, sapphire dressage bridle. I should grab the matching bows, which for some reason are 80 star coins. I don't understand why they're so expensive. And let's grab some leg grabs, which I don't think I can use the open bootlegs, but I can buy, buy these ones. 35 things. I'm going to buy this black one with the, with the white ribbon, I think. I think that one's kind of pretty. And I don't have any pets. Let's see, is there a pet that- Oh wait, no, there is pets. There's matching pets in this store. I always forget because they don't have a special section. Let's see, we have this one here, which is very pretty. I might buy this one. But I do have like red on my elbows here and there is actually like a red- Oh, I don't have any spring tokens though, do I? So I probably can't buy it. I'm pretty sure there's one in global store. Yeah, there's like red flowers here. I'll buy these ones too, Valentine's Day bouquet. I don't know, let's wear the red flowers. And now let's get on. Now I'm very sorry that it is sunset in the game right now, but uh, I couldn't help it. Unfortunately, playing on a different server region means that it's different time zones. I'm not gonna do the Equestrian Festival quests on camera because obviously I've already filmed them for YouTube videos. So let's get started. I'm seeing a little, I think Conrad has something to say with me. Now I haven't done this for at least a couple of months, so I can't really remember what's going on. Maybe you guys can remember better than me. I do have a playlist of all of the Back to the Beginning videos in order, so you can go check that out, but let's go ahead and talk to Conrad. Listen up, Cassandra. Let's continue our work with your horseshoes. You know what to do now. We're going to do the same thing today, but in a different order over and over. Follow my instructions closely. Oh, how fun. Doing horseshoes. Okay. Oh, I have to get off my horse. Oh my gosh. Heat the iron in the forge. I feel like my hand is more in the f Oh no, this, this angle is okay. This angle is okay. Before, my hand was more in the fire than the actual stick. I miss doing quests like this. I feel like there's not really any quests like this that we get like new in Star Stable anymore. Like there's no click and drag or anything like that. It's all just you click a button and it's done for you. I miss doing this in new quests in Star Stable. All right, there we go. Well done, now the metal needs to set until tomorrow, then we can start again. We will need more Jorvik iron then, and you need to go get it before we can start. Listen up, Cassandra, we need more Jorvik iron for the horseshoes. Alright, so I'm kind of zooming through this because we have already done this before, but might as well do it right now. Oh, the animation's not working. That's so sad. I'm just standing here. It's kind of surreal to me. I'm just reflecting on this now because when I first started YouTube, I always wanted to do a Let's Play. I always just wanted to do a Let's Play of the full game for you guys. Mainly because I watched, um, is it Stacy Plays? No. Stacy Place? But I was really, I loved her Let's Play video. So I was like, I always want to do a Let's Play when I'm, when I'm, I want to do a successful, you know, let's play and just play the game. And the fact that I can now for at least, you know, some of you guys, so I get comments like every week and they're like, hey, I really love back at the beginning. Are you doing it again? And it just warms my heart that I get to, you know, make child me happy and I get to do a let's play series that, you know, actually did really well on my channel. And even though like every new episode doesn't get the same like 50k views or whatever, you guys still really enjoy it. And that's just really bittersweet to me. Oh my gosh. Okay, now that is a daily quest thing. Let's head over, hmm, Cape West Fishing Village. Let's go to Cape West Fishing Village. And oh, actually, do we have any main quests? Oh yeah, we do. Oh yeah, that's right. We have to go to the riding arena. I remember, I remember. I said in the last video that we're gonna be at the riding arena. And then I forgot, cause it's been so long. It's been months, I think. <sighs> it's main story time, baby. Oh my God. Oh, she's facing the wrong way. Hey, Alex. I thought I would you 
Ugh. I thought I would find you around here somewhere. We've had a bit of a breakthrough in our re in our search for Justin. I can't read today. Why am I doing this? Mario from the Astronomical and Archaeological Society. Archeol I said that right, didn't I? In your book. You know, was lucky enough to pick up a radio message when he was working with his radio equipment. Tell me when you're ready to listen, because this is very important, and I want you to listen carefully. I am ready. Ears are peeled. The fact is that the message was strange, and Mario didn't pick up everything, but he thinks that the message was about Dark Horse shipping Justin's horse to some beach near here. The horse will be received by someone called the Dark Rider Malumi, or something like that. I have my suspicions about who might be using that code name. Apparently this dark rider will be transporting the horse to some place in Golden Hills Valley. Justin's horse is going to be picked up at the beach. We need to follow the dark rider to see where they are taking Justin's horse. It's time. I will watch the South Iron Gate from here. I thought you could watch the southern beach in Golden Hills Valley. Just down from the broken bridge that goes over the ravine and connects to the beach with Golden Leaf Forest. I've marked the place on your map. We've sent some other friends to other locations on the Golden Road and around the Labyrinth Shore so that no Dark Rider will be able to get past us unnoticed. Hurry to your post now, Cassandra, and watch out. This is for real. It's not a game. Oh my gosh, I'm not playing a game. I'm not playing Star Stable anymore. This is real life. Oh my gosh. I'm so slow. <laughs> this must be the place Alex meant. There is a good overview of the whole beach from here and the bushes make for a good hiding place. What bushes? Do you mean barrels? Time to hide and wait and see what happens. Even if I don't see the Dark Rider, the others will let me know if they see anything. Waiting. Oh yes, no one's gonna see me on my horse behind here completely. Can I take a picture? No, I can't. I can't take a picture. I wanted to take a thumbnail picture. Hiding in them bushes be like... Oh my gosh, we're fading to black. Something's about to happen. Ooh, cutscene, cutscene, cutscene. I remember this cutscene. Isn't it the person in red or something? Oh my gosh, it is. Look at them walk. Oh my gosh, doing this Let's Play series takes me back to 2014. <laughs> That's when I got Star Rider and I got to continue all the quests like this one. Oh yes, yeah, strutted. He's literally doing a model walk. That is such a model. You should stop being a Dark Rider and purely become a model. Like, look at you. Fabulous. Oh my gosh. Pure silence. Maybe I should turn the music on. This is very awkward. <gasps> I think they saw me. Did they see me? Look at that. What's it called? A dolly? No, it's a, it's a, oh my gosh, no. It's a specific zoom out on an angle. I, my film brain is failing me. I'm going to turn the music on really quick though. Really quick though. There's no music playing. No doubt it was Justin's horse that was handed over to the dark rider. I have to follow them. I have to follow them do. Oh to see where they are going. I can't get too close or they'll see me and I can't stay too far behind or I will lose track of the Dark Rider. Oh, we're doing one of those things. Okay. Attention. Follow the Dark Rider. Don't ride too close. Is this like too close? Too far away? I think this is a good, good spacing. Good spacing. Like dressage, like dressage. <laughs> this is not dressage spacing. Can I take a picture now? Yes, I can. Ah, oh, perfect. It makes me want to cry because it's so nostalgic. Ah! Oh my gosh, they sped up. Oh, speedy boy. <laughs> it's so scary. It's like, duh. <laughs> oh my gosh, are we about to unlock Pie the Witch's place? <gasps> the wolves chase you and your horse away from their territory. Oh, is that something that happens? Is this part of the quest? Oh gosh, I didn't- wait. Since when did the wolves chase you away? I'm deeply saddened right now. That was- this is gonna take me so- oh my gosh. I didn't know the wolves chased you away. I thought they just barked at you. <laughs> barked? Oh, <laughs> uh, you know what I mean? Do I have to do that whole quest line again? Okay, let's go. Doing this again. Speed it up. No! No! Ah. No! 
I'm 18 years old. How did I do this as an eight year old? <laughs> ah! I don't understand how I'm meant to get past the wolves. How do you play this game anymore? This is not a child game. I have to do it again. It takes me so long. <laughs> My computer ran out of space, but we're back. I think I'm doing it, I think I'm doing it, I think I'm doing it, I think I'm doing it. Oh my gosh, I'm so stressed. <laughs> oh, I'm very close right now, okay. Let's just come over by these rocks, you know, hide behind the rocks. I think they're gonna go through the gate. <gasps> oh my gosh, they unlocked the gate. And they opened it. Why does this gate need two lanterns on it? <laughs> Oh my gosh, it closed behind them. How am I meant to get inside? Oh no. Our gate. It's closed. The dark rider vanished along the road after the north iron gate. The, no the iron gate is closed and locked. You can't get through. Write to Alex at south iron gate and tell her what you saw. Alex. Oh my gosh, Alex. See, the wolves don't like upset me when I ride past now. It must have just been in... No, they do. What? Why? Do we like become friends with them later on? I swear on my main account, the wolves don't get mad at me. Oh my gosh. It must just be part of a quest which I don't remember. Whoa. That makes me feel so old. Alex, Alex, I saw someone. I saw someone. You saw the Dark Rider? Tell me what you saw, Cassandra. Okay, Cassandra, well done. So the Dark Rider took Justin's horse past the North Iron Gate. But what and who is there? Why are you taking Justin's horse there? These are questions we'll never know the answer to if we can't get past that gate somehow. Any suggestions? Hmm, you think we should ask old man Jasper if he has any idea of what's hiding behind the gate? And if he doesn't know how to get past it, we can ask Mayor Claus for the key to the city. Good thinking. Jasper lives right next to here. I'll see you at his place. Okay, I thought she was like gonna ride off in the other direction. And I was like, Alex, where are we going? Hi, am I meant to be talking to you right now? Does Jasper know something? Oh, do we have to wait for Alex to come by? Okay, Alex, hurry up! Alex, just run through the pumpkins, it's fine! Jasper has not been holding his shovel for so long. It's disappointing. Welcome, Alex, you took your sweet time. And you're turning the wrong way as well. You gotta look at Jasper. You wanna know what's behind the North Iron Gate? Well, youngsters, it's been a long, long time since I've been there, but I'll do my best. It's no use. It was over 20 years ago that I last set foot past the North Iron Gate. They always open in spring, just like the South Gate, if my memory serves me right. But from what I've heard, they locked it up years ago and it hasn't been open since. Strange, but true. But let's see, the area past the gate. That was a nice area, let me tell ya. Let's see, there was a forest and a beautiful summer house. A road that led up to an old fort. It was very impressive. The summer house was owned by Mayor Claus and his adorable wife. Why are you calling Mayor Claus's wife adorable? Um, now that I'm older reading this questline, I'm a little concerned. I can't remember her name. You just remember that she was adorable? I'm okay, okay, okay. Oh, maybe Star Stable didn't mean it like that. It was a wonderful time. I remember us eating pumpkin ice cream on the porch in the summer. Ew, pumpkin ice cream? Interesting. Alex, you're still not looking at Jasper. Okay, it seems like someone is living past the North Line Yate and maybe in the mayor's old summer house. We have lots to do, Cassandra. Right over to Cape West Fishing Village and speak with Claus. Ask him about his summer house and about his wife. Also, ask to borrow the key to the city so we can open the North Line Gate. I'll watch the gate to see if the Dark Rider or anyone else comes out or if anyone else goes through. For that matter, I'll see you there later. Okay, dokie. Mayor Claus. I see, you want to know about my summer house and about my wife? You know what? I just remembered something I have to do. I also suddenly can't remember anything at- I can't remember in anything at all? Gotta run, folks. Tata! No, at least give me the key! Give me the key! Hunt down? Oh my gosh, wow, that was so difficult. You caught me, Cassandra. How silly of me to think I could just outrun you and your horse. I certainly can't outrun my past. Oh well, you can't hide from your past, so I might as well tell you about everything. My wife and I were so happy together and we had a wonderful summer house at a mountain lake beyond the North Iron Gate. But my wife became interested in all sorts of hocus pocus type of things and she began to brew strange witch potions. I was really worried about her. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot. The witch is Maya Claus's wife. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Finally, one day I, I returned to find our beautiful mountain lake had turned into a dark swamp. 
and my wife had turned into an evil witch. There was nothing more I could do for her. Until this day, she's completely lost in her world of potions and witchcraft. It breaks my heart. So you want to meet her? I don't think she will listen to a word you say, my friend. My dear wife is gone and that witch is all that remains. It breaks my heart just to think about it. But obviously I won't stand in your way if you want to try. You have helped me and my village a great deal already, so of course I will do my best to help you in any way I can. Here is the key to the city. With this key, you can unlock the North Iron Gate. Good luck now, if you do meet my darling wife. Please tell her I still love her and she is always welcome home. Ooh, secret quest, secret quest. It's a rock. No, it's dirt. We'll come back to that in a later episode. Unless I forget. Ah, uh, see, I missed this. We get to drag the key. We never get to drag anything in Star Stable anymore. That was really loud. Wouldn't they have heard that? Yes, it worked. I can give the key. I can give the key, key back to Claws later. I have some things to take care of in the fishing village, anyways. Okay then, ride off and try to find the witch. I agree with you that the witch and the dark rider probably have some really bad intentions for Justin's poor horse. I'm aware she can help us find Justin, but be careful. I'll keep watching the gate, and I'll be here if you need any help. All right, let's go in. Let's go into the creepy, creepy darkness. Oh my gosh, down into the deep dark, down deep down. I really would have liked to see this place with its beautiful river and the lake house, but apparently we can't, it's fine. I'll survive. This part is always the worst. Like, when's it going to appear? There we go. So otherwise, I don't know when to jump. Like, this place would have been very pretty, I believe. <gasps> oh my gosh, Justin's horse is up in the air. Ha ha ha, abracadabra. You think you can just walk in here and get me to talk at your command? Ha ha ha, aren't you the funny one? I think I'll transform you and your silly horse to teach you a lesson. <gasps> oh no, no. Oh my gosh. We've turned into a frog. Oh my gosh, my poor horse. Okay, but seriously, I would love to have a horse broomstick to ride. Like, imagine buying a horse that is a broomstick horse. I, I like that idea. The spell is broken. It's obvious that Pi is not in the mood for talking. So I guess we go back and talk to uh, Alex. A real nasty witch. You would turn into a frog? Oops. Lucky for you, it wasn't for very long. So, the mayor's wife is actually the witch, Pi, and obviously not at all willing to cooperate. She's keeping Justin's horse in a big cage. Hmm, we have to do something. Linda is smart, well-read, and is in the area, over by the equestrian center. Right over to Linda and ask her for some suggestions on what to do. I'll keep watching the gate so nobody can sneak in and take Justin's horse or anything. So, where'd the Dark Rider though, go, though? Is the Dark Rider still in there? Because obviously we didn't see the Dark Rider come out. I suppose Alex didn't see the Dark Rider come out. Was she like in the house or something? Are we going to be tattletailed one or something? Oh my gosh, it's Linda. Linda, hello. Hey Cassandra, are you headed to the Equestrian Festival? Wait, what? Oh my, there's two Lindas. Ah! <laughs> Why is Linda here? I'm so confused. This isn't my home stable. Why is... Oh, I'm so confused. <laughs> Hello, Cassandra. I have a lot going on right now, but if you say it is if it, you say it is really important, I will absolutely help out. That's what friends are for. Okay, I understand. You need a way to get that witch Pi to see you. Poor Claws having a wife who has turned into a witch. I hope we can find a way to restore Pi to that nice lady she used to be. Well, I don't know. I think we'll have to do some research on this one, and that means the library. The vineyard has a fantastic library. I spent many hours with my nose buried in those exciting books. Come on, let's go right now. Okay, let's go. Should I, like, walk with you, Linda? Here, I'll walk with you. Or, like, jog next to you? Because you're, like, you're a really fast walker. Too slow for my running. Look how fancy these doors are. Oh my gosh, in the library. I like the library. It's cool in here. What do you think? Pretty amazing, right? A really good library, full of the collected knowledge from centuries past. You can almost feel the books bragging to each other about all their wisdom and plotting on how to force this information into your mind. So much to read, so little time. We need to find the right books to find the answer of how to turn the witch back into her old kind self. Or at least get her to tell you the truth. I'll sit here and look through the witch witch co witchopedia. <laughs> first. Search the library for books about witches and if you find any, bring them over here. -da 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 -da. Looking for some witch books. Witch books. Witch books. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Oh my gosh. Se ah, se seven. Eight. 
Oh my gosh, I can phase through these chairs. Can I phase through Linda? No, I can't. Okay. Nice find. Now we have a pile of exciting books about witches that we need to plow through. This is going to take a while. You can help me with these books. Let's look for information on how to make witches more cooperative. Here, sit down and read these four books. Okie dokie. Reading. Yo, the book actually opens. That's amazing. Two. Whoops. Three. And four. Oh my gosh, there's a giant star in the ceiling that I could not see. I'm so blind. Let's grab it. Thank you for your help. You did find some useful information, but we need more. Oh, and it's a timed quest. Well, I think that's going to end this Let's Play episode for today. In the next one, we'll probably continue off with Linda and uh, see where it goes from there. So, oh my, I can't get a good angle of this outro. So let me know if you like the Let's Plays. I don't know. But we're making some good progress in the main quest. We have a ton of side quests to complete though. Look at all these quests. That's a lot of chatter. But I hope you guys are having an awesome day or have had an awesome day and I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye!